What's up, everybody? BT in the garage coming at you with a final take. You know it. You know it's here. Jack Wolf Knives, right? In this awesome box, what we have here. That's right. The Gunslinger Jack. Now, this was another surprise drop. Did not see this coming. And yeah, I can't be more happy. So you get the Pog. As usual, the towel, this embossed in Jack Wolf knives, and uh, of course the sticker, which is always awesomely stuck to the wall and never wants to come out for me because it stuck to the wall. Um, come on now. <laughs> um, what did you do today? Well, I fought a sticker. It just, you know, that's how it works. You got to fight it sometimes because it's so perfectly shaped to the can, the tin, that it doesn't want to come out. But you do get a sticker. Trust me. I will get it. Bam! There's a sticker. I'm your Huckleberry from the movie Tombstone. Absolutely amazing. So this is what you get, right? And, of course, you also get this wrapped up in that absolutely amazing 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 knife now you're gonna move move all that you also get a filler tab so if you don't want the clip because this does come with a beautiful metal clip that is essentially a masterpiece of a right hand carry but if you don't want that you can take the clip off and you can put the plug in. Now the plug is the same anodized as the clip. This is bazooka pink and a fat, whatever, uh, fat, a camo carbon bazooka pink has a blue anodized clip, a blue anodized backspacer. Yes, it's a backspacer, it's not a spring because this is a locking knife. As you can see here, here's the bolster lock. Absolutely amazing, guys. Uh, did not see this coming, but so, so happy it did. So impressive. The top flipper works perfectly. The fuller on it, which is technically kind of the long pull, works perfectly. The detent is pretty damn good. I mean, pretty solid, man. Um, so let me set it down, let you guys check it all out look at it all and i'll uh give you a little bit of the the rundown on the old uh gunslinger right so as i said this and showed you this is a locking knife this is not a slip joint now it is this is awesome because i haven't seen this happen yet from anybody now modern take slip joints th this is what jack will knives is about it's what ben does and he does it the best in my opinion he takes classic designs with modern materials right that's what you get you get a classic design modern material and normally what you get here is the sharpshooter which was the very first one this is in the marble carbon fiber with the blue absolutely love this knife and this is what you get this is the gun stock pattern right clip point blade hollow grind is amazing this is the back spring the quality is outstanding the pull the fit the finish it's amazing right but that's that's what you get this is is like kind of a first i haven't really seen this anywhere else here it is, modern but traditional gunstock pattern. That's why it's called the uh, gunslinger, right? You get that classic gunstock pattern, but now it's a it's a freaking folding locking knife, man. It's a locking knife, absolutely super smooth and amazing. By the way, guys, skips and um, slips are going to be available on the site like now, right? Um, anyway, this is the, uh, 
Let me move some of this again. This is the first Jack Wolf knives to ever release last year. And this is the sharpshooter. This is the gunslinger. As you can see, the gunslinger is a little bigger. It's got more handle. It's also got more blade. There is nothing wrong with this size right here. It's amazing, right? Absolutely amazing. Fits in the hand, amazing. The ergos are amazing. This is also amazing. Absolutely amazing, man. It's, it's, ah, Ben is the man, right? This is awesome, right? So, let me give you the specs. A little run. I'm going to leave that up there because it's such a beautiful knife. Let me give you the specs, the rundown, real quick on this uh, brand new locking knife from Jack Wolf Knives. As I said, the pattern is the gun stock. As you can see, it is the same. It's the gun stock. Um, it is a bolster lock. It is running on a ceramic bearings. It is This one is camo carbon bazooka pink. With the uh, blue titanium clip. Uh, it is 6AL4V titanium, of course. This is S90V, as you can see there. As opposed to the slip joint version was M390. Which is absolutely amazing. Um, <clears throat> what you have here is a hollow ground crucible S90V. It is a closed length of 4.12 inches or 104.8 millimeter, blade length of 3.23, or 82.1 millimeter, the cutting edge of 2.86. Um, scale to scale is 0 0.46, 11.7 millimeter, or 5 eighths of an inch. Um, blade stock is 0 0.12, or 3 millimeter. Weight is 2.9 ounces. Yep, it's not heavy at all, which is severely awesome. The HRC is 61, and if you guys really need to know, it is still made in China. That shouldn't even matter at this point. Um, this is; These are both amazing. If you're looking for a slip joint, you can't beat Jack Wolf knives, right? Um, it's probably going to be hard to find this particular model, but this is getting ready to launch, guys. And if you're not a slip joint guy and you're a locking knife guy and you just do not want a slip joint... But you like the looks. You want to know, is this comfortable? <laughs> super comfortable, man. Super, super comfortable. Um, these are dropping, right? Today. This video came out this morning, early morning. These are dropping today, Friday the 16th. I uh, believe, if I'm not mistaken, they're going to be $350, which that's extremely good. This is a $300 knife. So $50 more for quite a difference in size, material, um, a locking blade. I think that's really good for this knife and what you're getting. Um, yeah, $350. They dropped to today. Uh, pretty sure at 2 p.m. Eastern, which is like... 11 11 a.m pacific standard time yeah 11 a.m pacific standard time guys 2 p.m eastern all major retailers i'll have them linked in the description below um if you guys want to know this knife moved way up the list for my folding knives um this is my favorite folding knife that i own um for a lot of reasons it's not the most expensive it is my favorite, and I love this knife. And this knife, if you look at them, they are really close in size, right? And this knife has quickly become, man, number two right now, but it, it, might, take, it, it might take number one, I'm not going to lie. Um, the ergos on that are a little bit better. I, I, have, I love this knife, man. Kevin and Colin knocked it out of the park with this design. I'm serious. My two favorite knives right here. But this knife, guys, 350 absolutely mind-boggling that you're going to get it at that price. Right? Mind-boggling. It's an amazing, amazing knife. I mean, 
Ah, man, amazing. Comes in awesome, awesome, amazing color. This bazooka pink. Bazooka pink. It also comes in, I believe, a camo carbon toxic green, a fat carbon dark matte gold, which looks amazing, both those, and fat carbon arctic storm, and fat carbon purple haze. I mean, guys, you're you're getting five five different versions you can buy this knife in. Absolutely worth it. Beyond worth it. Um, it's amazing. It's, it's mind-blowing. Ben has, you know, he did a surprise job with, before this with the, the Feel Good Jack. Absolutely amazing doctor's knife. Um, you, you uh, wasn't prepared for that. And then I'm thinking, oh, we're going to finally get the humpback jack. It's coming. He's going to drop it. And bam, he drops this, right? in our face, dropping in our face right now, and I'm like in shock because it's, it's not only such a gorgeous piece, but the quality of this matches the quality of this. The quality of the slip joints are outrageous, man. The spring is, there's little no gaps. Spring is completely flush. It's always flat at every stop. It's got a solid six and a half. I call it a seven on this one. Pull. Um, super sharp. It, same thing here with the folding knife. The backspacer is perfectly flush with the blade. There's really no gap. There, there's a groove there. There's no gap. You can't see any daylight. There's no daylight. Um, it, it's just... it's a. It truly is mind-boggling on how good this this is i mean <laughs> it it is an amazing knife man right now it's this could be easily this this is oh man this, this is probably going to be knife of the year i mean right now it's easily knife of the year um out of everything i've had now i don't get it all i haven't had a lot i've been real busy you know but I've had some good stuff this year. The Quiet Carry 9 is an extremely good knife. Absolutely amazing knife. And I, it's definitely in the, in the running for knife of the year. But I'm telling you guys, this is possibly knife of the year already. And we're halfway through right now. This is the June, right? And you, you can't... I'm telling you, this thing is out of the world, man. It's how good it is. It's... It's kind of scary because now Ben has literally proven that he's not only what I what I call one of the best, if not the best right now, he's definitely the best at modern traditional. Um, he's my favorite slip joint designer and company. But now he's put his foot in the game over here at the folding knife. I mean, triple flute, single flute. Double bolstered. Oh, man. Absolutely amazing. This is amazing. And this should... People should be looking at Jack Wolf Knives right now going, wow. Um, he just... He just showed you that he can step right into that folding locking knife world and compete. And it's amazing. It's amazing. It's amazing. It's absolutely amazing, man. Um, I couldn't get this at a better time. It was my birthday on the 13th. And I, I just, like, amazing knife to receive for, for that. You know, I, it wasn't a birthday present. But, man, you, I like to call it one because it's the best thing I've seen and had in my hand this whole month so far. Um, anyway, guys, that's my final take. This knife is completely worth $350. It's probably really worth more. Um, amazing hands-down knife. If you guys don't jump on this, I don't know what's wrong with you. I'm sorry. I'm not, not trying to say, you know, anything bad about you or anybody else, but this, this is, this is, this is something else, man. 
this is something else. And that's just, it's crazy good. You can middle finger flick it. You can top flick it. You can thumb flick it. No problem. It's just crazy good. Um, as always, huge shout out to Ben for sending this out for me to check out, for me to, you know, make make a video on it and show you guys, tell you guys what I think, why, what it's about. Um, so, you know, love the guy. The guy is amazing. He's got an amazing company. Obviously doing amazing things, man. Amazing things. Anyway, guys, I hope your week's been great. Your weekend's going great. I hope everything's going good. Um, there might be a pause in videos, even longer pause. The fire season's among us. It's pretty crazy out there. Um, as you guys on the East Coast know, Canada is just blazing right now. Um, things are in the works of being done. It takes a lot of manpower and a lot of time and a lot of money to get those things done. So, anyway... Uh, I hope you guys are having a great day, week, month, day, hour, doing whatever it is you're doing out there. Always, as always, you know, get out there, do something positive for yourself. Do something positive for somebody else. Make yourself happy by making somebody else happy. Always take care of and respect your veterans. And I'll definitely catch you guys in the next one.